Christmas donkey. La 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 It had been weeks since Potato last uploaded. His subscribers, distraught by his absence, worried that something had happened to him. Though these concerns were dismissed as irrational fears, several days passed and slowly his disappearance burdened more and more people until his face was on the front page of each newspaper. Finally, the pleads for an investigation were answered by two detectives wearing ridicule on their sleeves. One of them, Kyle Goldberger, lunged for the opportunity to change their reputation for the better. But with few leads and little evidence, he struggles to make sense of it all. Yo, Kyle, I just got a new case for us. What? Potato, he's missing. Dude, he's been missing for like three weeks. What? 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 Turn around. Are you a huge Mateo fan, or have we had this for a while? We have for a while. He's gone completely missing. What? Okay. You see what the New York Times says about us? Laughing stocks? Come on! Come on! We got the potato case! It's our chance! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Why do you have pictures of Newton? It's the key to the whole thing. What is? It's Newton's laws. When did we get this case? Well, three weeks ago. Here's what I thought. This was idea number one. We went to Matato's Tunnel O' Pain video. We followed the steps. Step one, start running. Step two, keep running. Step four, keep running. What about step three? Step three, keep breathing. Step four, you keep running. See where I'm going with this? I think so. We gotta, we gotta go, go to the Tunnel of Pain! Here with my friend Nick Spudito. I think we're close. I think we're pretty close. We're on, this, we're on the trail. The Tunnel of Pain Trail. Kyle, we found it! The Tunnel of Pain! We need to figure out what happened to him, and the only way to do that is to recreate his steps. I know what to do. Step one. Start running. You run, I'll investigate! Yes, Kyle! Okay. So if we look around, there's really not much evidence to take from this. But, if I remember my 11th grade honors physics class, the one thing I can really remember is, an object in motion stays in motion, and an object at rest stays at rest. Since there's no unbalanced force acting on Potato, he had to keep running, because like Kyle said, it's his core value. Kyle! He must have kept running! So at some point, he must have reached a cliff. He tried to stop before the cliff, but his inertia, or his resistance to change in motion, didn't let him, and he ran off. From there, there was one force acting on him, and that's force weight, causing him to fall to his death three weeks ago. Mommy, that doesn't make any sense. With all the YouTube views he's been racking up, he's been rolling in the dough. He's, he'd have be able to afford a great pair of running shoes. It caused so much friction, he'd be able to stop right before he fell off the cliff. 
With that theory discredited, the laughingstock detectives returned to their headquarters to continue their search. Quality is quality. That's my motto. Subscribe to me. Yeah, you got to. Quality is quality. That's my motto. Subscribe to me. Yeah, you got to agree. Quantity is quality. That's my motto. Subscribe to me. Quantity yeah, you got to. Is quality. What if the answer was here all along? That's my motto. But his quantity got so high, his quality couldn't maintain. It's student second law! If Matt truly believed in quantity equals quality, then when munching on his favorite snack, carrots, he could have put on a lot of mass. According to the second law of motion, if the force is constant and the mass is increasing, the acceleration will drop. He could get to a point in his F equals MA statement where his mass is so large that there's little to no acceleration. Without any acceleration, he couldn't run, and without running, he couldn't be the YouTube sensation that we all have come to love and cherish. If we ever crack this case, make sure you subscribe to Potato. A message brought to you by the Washington Street Cafe. Kyle! That doesn't make any sense. If that were true, he would be daily vlogging his journey back to fitness. My last idea. Matt was planning until he left on releasing a fire diss track on one of these two subjects. If you release a fire diss track, they could flame him right back. Wait, they could what? They could, they could hit him right back. They, they could diss him back. Cut. Do you just said? No. Yeah. Look at this. They could just. Hit him right back. Yeah. That's Newton's third law. We might be onto something. Hi, I'd like to speak to AIDS Nathan. Yeah, it's about to get roasted. Ooh. Sure, you got more steps than me, go ahead, take a bow. But at least my prize content isn't just staring at cows. Don't worry, I know those vids aren't your best. Since you're wrecking in a few sticks of someone else's success. I'm cringy and I know it, that's what divides me from you. Enter the tunnel of pain, we'll see just how you do. So no matter what, for every hit, there's a hit back. So for every force, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Oh. That was kind of mean, this and me, but you forget that I have. More views, more likes, more subs, more money. You think your content is so freaking funny, but give credit when credit. I'm a potato and it's time you all know I wrote this, I recorded that I do all the work, it's just my copycat You say quantity is quality when you have me there Months between videos to take a breather Took our bet to get your head in the game But my videos still be yours to shame Realizing that neither of the YouTubers had posted a diss track in the first place Kyle and Rami found themselves trapped in a dark, hopeless place they cursed themselves for thinking Newton's laws could solve the potato mystery. They were overwhelmed with guilt and secluded themselves from the world, hoping that by some unlikely chance, one day the YouTuber would return. The world is full of chances. There's opportunity down each path, and all that matters in the end is if you seize it. Because if you don't step back and look around, you might just miss it.